Hello and welcome back. So in this lecture, we are going to see the difference between two different API gateway API types. The first one is the REST, which is also known as the version one of uh, API gateway type. And another one is HTTP API, which is the newer version, uh, which is built to be faster and cheaper than version one. Till now, in our first Lambda example, we used the older version, the V1, the REST API version. And in our course, we are going to use uh, REST APIs for all our examples and lectures. HTTP API is a relatively new offering, which is designed for low latency, cost-effective integration uh, with different AWS services, which includes AWS Lambda and other HTTP endpoints. But REST API currently offer more features. I've added a link to the presentation here. So if you click at the link, it should take you to AWS documentation. So on this page, you will see that uh, there is a list of different features that both HTTP and REST API supports. So as you can see, under authorizers, integration, and API management, REST API currently support uh, more features than HTTP API. So HTTP is still evolving. Uh, most of the features are supported by both the API types, but REST API currently supports more. Uh, for example, REST API currently supports can re release deployment, or you can add custom gateway responses that you cannot for HTTP API. But again, HTTP API support a few features as setting the default stage, default route, uh, automatic deployments that REST API does not. So it's really up to you, your project's needs, and what you feel comfortable using. You can always go through the list of features that both API support and decide on which one to use. You can always use a mix of both HTTP API and REST API in a single uh, project based on individual endpoint or individual lambda function functions need so one important thing to note here is even though we are defining a rest api under events we define it as http so don't get confused with the naming when we define events as, as http it's actually a rest api the version one and if you want to define HTTP API, which is version two, we need to define it as HTTP API colon under the events. 